you have finally turned off the rain, turned up the heat, and it turns out those are perfect conditions for mosquitoes to thrive all across North Texas. And those of us who thought that deep February freeze might help, nope. Three months, 25 days, and a few hours ago. Uh, I think I tell you, I'm feeling freezing. I'm seeing a lot of snow, Cynthia. While suffering through a week of snow and ice and sub-freezing temperatures, I made a silly assumption. Surely this would impact mosquitoes. No, just the short answer, right? Entomologist Sonia Swiger from Texas A&M AgriLife set me straight. Turns out mosquito eggs are resilient. And the eggs are not bothered by weather changes and temperature changes and freezing temps. That, that really just doesn't throw them off their game. You know how disappointing that is to me because I vividly <laughs> remember telling myself at least it'll kill the mosquitoes and I was so wrong. I know, and I had a lot of conversation with people in February after all that too, and I tried to prepare. I'm like, no, it's not gonna have any impact because that's what most were really hoping for. <laughs> so cold does not hurt them, and rain can help them. Not those constant waves of rain we saw in May, but all the standing water left behind in June. Those will continue to grow mosquitoes. So it is time to check your property. Empty containers where rain has been collecting, cover up in bug spray, and face Texas's unfortunate mosquito reality. If a deep freeze can't get rid of them, it feels like nothing can. In Dallas, I'm Teresa Woodard. Guess we're all just gonna have to suffer through another summer of mosquitoes.